This is Red Feather from Grephax. In this video, we will be showing you how to remove black borders from a video or photos to be used in a video. These black borders can become present when they are loaded into Kading Live for a couple of reasons. One, the video or photo must be rotated, or two, they were taken at the wrong angle. For example, taking footage or photos on a phone, if you hold it straight up and down, this creates the black borders. Holding it sideways eliminates the issue unless rotation is required in Kading Live. Notice the black borders in the first part of this video. And then, as I remove them, utilizing Kading Live, the video now looks much cleaner. Open Kading Live, bring the video you wish to work with into Kading Live, place it on the timeline, of Kading Live. Click on the uh, effects list, type zoom in the search bar, grab the pan and zoom, and drop it into the video on the timeline. Notice the distort option in the pan and zoom effects box. This is very this is a very important function in this Kading Live procedure. Put a check mark in the box for the distort. The distort actually appears to stretch things out, as you will see. Next is to find the magic number to complete the Kading Live procedure. Only adjust the width. My magic number is 3600 in KDN Live. Yours could be different, so choose the one that best suits your needs. Then click on the video on the KDN Live timeline so the function sets in. Then just grab the plus sign and manually move it into place. Removing black borders from photos and Kading Live for video use is a lot easier, not only on oneself, but for your system as well. Because there is a lot less going on within a photo compared to a video. The procedure is the same minus two steps. Click on the effects list in, in Kading Live, type in zoom, drag the pan and zoom into the photo, put a check mark in the most important distort box. No other adjustment is needed. Notice how in Kading Live pan and zoom distort just stretches it to the full canvas. I hope you have found this video to be helpful in some manner. And if so, then why not give this video a like? And while you're at it, why not become a subscriber? After all, it is free. Please feel free to leave a comment. The intro and extra of this video has been provided by none other than Alex Abeyu1 from his YouTube channel. Thank you in advance. I am out.